For the past few months, Chinese jets have been flying over Taiwan's air defense zone. This causes grave concern of Taiwan's future and is the main point in which China shows its military might. This causes great concern that China may invade Taiwan. Why is China behaving aggressively towards Taiwan? Now we will learn about it. The Communist Party in the leadership of Mao Zedong took over China with the help of a peasant population overthrowing the democratic system. To continue the existence of the Democratic Republic, they, v they went over to Taiwan to keep it going. Taiwanese economy grew into a very prosperous and economically developed nation. From then on, China is saying that Taiwan is the part of them. But some countries aren't accepting that they are the part of the People's Republic of China. For more than 70 years, they have been living in this threat of this growing superpower. But now it is becoming reality and it is said that China will invade Taiwan. There has been many military drills going on over China over amphibious warfare and this has been growing over the past few years as China has been investing heavily on, mid on the military. They have been having many military and navy exercises in the Taiwanese trade which causes grave concern for Taiwan. But Taiwanese president says we will never bow down to Chinese incursions. Biden says that the United States military will defend Taiwan in any Chinese invasion and has confirmed that the United States military is exercising and training in Taiwanese soil. They have been training there for a past few months and hoping that this wouldn't be a reality an invasion would become a great catastrophe for the Democratic Republic of Taiwan. Now let's see how China can invade Taiwan. To invade Taiwan, China should specialize in amphibious warfare. There are only 13 spots where Taiwan can have such an invasion. They send all their warships through the Taiwanese Strait, but this should be only be sent in the months of March, as there won't be any strong storms in the Taiwanese Strait. This gives enough time for the Taiwanese military to train and equip themselves with high-quality equipment from the United States military. To transport all the material or the army to carry them through the strait, they need a very powerful fleet of many cargo ships, as China has been saying, to keep many artillery and other military equipment on their ship. Millions of tons of cargo and other military equipment can be transported through these ships, which gives an advantage for China. Artillery shells will reign over the incoming Chinese military. They may cut all the trees in the beaches, which results in the lack of defensive positions for the Chinese military, which causes exposure to active gunfire. So when they will land, only half of the fleet will be in the shores of Taiwan. Why, you may ask, it's all because of mines. The Taiwanese military has been planting mines for more than many years, so this causes many damage to all the sh gunfire and rain, and the Chinese military will be destroyed. Invasion of Taiwan will be a very hard task to achieve.